weed in Barcelona and Amsterdam style coffee shops? Folks, the answer is no, I'm sorry. Barcelona weed uh, is a hot topic. Uh, everybody's looking around and wanting to know about it. I've made a video about it earlier in my series and you can check that out. But in terms of Amsterdam style coffee shops that are open and legal for tourists, it doesn't exist here, folks. You may hear some stories to the contrary, but those those were no, there are no legal coffee shops here in Barcelona. This is James Whalen. I'm throwing everything I can at you to help you. I've been just reading forums, listening to questions, and I'm just trying to solve problems for you. So here's the situation. There are cannabis clubs for local residents. Legally, you have to be a local resident. Um, for a lot of the cannabis clubs, you have to be uh, referred by a member. And the thing about these cannabis clubs is it's, their, they, it's in their interest to be very strict about the rules because they have no desire to, to be, get shut down just because a couple of tourists wanted to smoke up one weekend. So the legit cannabis clubs around here are not going to service tourists. And what I hear, I'm, I'm not, I don't have experience with them, but what I hear is that they're very diligent. Um, so in these cannabis clubs, locals, people with a local residency card, are able to go in and smoke out. That said, uh, you can find anything you want if you look hard enough for, for it. Should you do that? I don't know. Um, but I've heard stories, I've read, I've read, read little stories about people on the Rambla. You know, on the Rambla, you can pretty much find anything. And I would basically uh, advise you to avoid almost everything on the Rambla, starting from the coffees and normal legitimate stores up to whatever end of the, other end of the spectrum there is. I've heard stories that people um, are coming up to tourists and offering them a service like a, an Amsterdam style coffee shop and that people have gone there and had good experiences with it. Um, you might find that it's not a legit place. Um, it, there could be consequences of it. You may get in and get out and have a great time. I don't know. I personally think that just one thing I would throw at you is you don't really want to get in trouble with the police in a foreign country. You don't want to get in trouble with the police in your own country. Uh, if you really want to be an idiot and take these kind of risks, just stay at home, folks. Uh, you cannot legally come here as a tourist and go into any establishment and smoke out. And the kind of places that are offering you that service, well, I don't know what, what kind of quality you're really expecting or what kind of environment you're really looking for, but there's nothing here. If you really want that experience, why not just go to Amsterdam? Barcelona is Barcelona. This is James Whalen. I'm having a fantastic time uh, talking to you and just trying to help you out with any problems and questions. People are sending me questions. I'm finding different uh, answers for them. I'm looking around and I want to know what you need, uh, what I can do to help you on your trip that you're thinking about or if you're here already. Let me hear from you. Uh, this is James Whalen. I have an, and I uh, hope you have a fantastic day like I am. I'm still in my running clothes. I've been out jogging around and we're going to see you next time on the next video. Smash the like button. That means just take it out and just crash it onto the ground. You know you're loving it. Thank you so much, folks, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.